With the world facing rising food demand and the challenges of climate change, how can technology help us grow crops that stay healthy and productive? I'm Assistant Professor Tedrick Liu from the Department of Chemical and Biomolecular Engineering at CDE. Here at the Liu Lab, I lead a multidisciplinary team of researchers working at the intersection of nanotechnology, plant biology, chemistry, and engineering to shape the future of urban farming. Using advanced nanosensors and nanocarriers, we are developing tool sets that let us communicate with living plants. This helps us engineer smarter crops and build our understanding of how plants work, all in real time. One part of our research is the development of fluorescent nanosensors that can be embedded into plant tissues to show when they are stressed. When plants experience stress, these nanoparticles change fluorescence, which we can capture with a smartphone camera or other portable devices. This allows farmers to monitor plant health continuously, detecting stress factors well before visible signs like yellowing or wilting appear. These sensors can be applied to any plant species and are tuned to track specific molecules plants use to communicate stress. Another area of our lab's research is developing nanocarriers, tiny delivery systems that transport proteins, genes, or agrochemicals directly to the parts of a plant that need them. By delivering nutrients or treatments exactly where they are needed, we can make fertilizers and pesticides much more efficient, using far less and reducing their impact on the environment. It also helps crops become stronger against diseases and other stresses, even helping them adapt to harsher climates. Going forward, we are also beginning to study how plants interact with helpful microbes and microorganisms that can boost nutrient uptake, growth, and stress tolerance in plants. By developing nano tools to study these relationships, we hope to create healthier crops that deliver higher yields and can withstand a changing climate. We are also focused on making our nanotechnologies more plant-friendly, learning how they affect plants at the molecular level to design nanoparticles which are biocompatible and improve plant health. With a changing climate, growing population, and rapid urbanization, how we feed ourselves in the future will be a major challenge. The technologies we are developing at CDE could help transform food crop production shaping a more sustainable future for agriculture and enhancing food security. <music>